Hi everyone, my name is Brian and I'm the 3D Print Creator. In this episode, I'm going to talk with you about the mistake I made. I was thinking I did something really, really great, but I ended up, well, it's not that great. So, after the break you'll see what I did wrong. So you made it after the break. Well, what happened is that when I ordered a large quantity of electronics, uh, some eBay manufacturer sent me this piece here. And uh, this is a thermostat. And uh, well, they sent me a whole lot of those things instead of Arduino boards. They should have uh, sent me some Arduino boards. But I got these things. So uh, basically when I complained about it, uh, I got them for free because they gave me back my, uh, my money I paid for it and I didn't have to send this back. But what happened? Uh, well, I built this one inside something I built and uh, I created myself and it's for a fan duct. What I was doing is I was hoping that I could uh, make a cooler on my printer and let that cooler cool everything that comes out of my nozzle so I could run my nozzle faster I could have larger bridges uh, that kind of things and, and you see it on, on a lot a lot of good printers they have coolers which cool the filament as soon as it comes out of the nozzle well my printer it hasn't has a thing like that so I did have to do something else so I made a cooler which senses the temperature uh, around the nozzle in the surrounding of the nozzle and when it senses that the temperature goes higher than a given preset uh, then it turns on uh, my fan and uh, the fan starts cooling the nozzle and it works great it, it, it really does uh, I can set it for different temperatures so I can set it for example uh, to switch on at 20 degrees or at 30 degrees or at 50 degrees, 80, whatever I want to. And uh, you can also see that those temperatures are getting reached. So if I'm printing ABS for example then I can set it to uh, 45 degrees and uh, well it will work perfectly. And when I print for example PLA then I can do it at 31 degrees because uh, at 31 degrees when my uh, fan goes on then it starts cooling and it will reach 31 degrees just by heating the print beds to 40 degrees and so it will work but what I didn't expect is that there is, uh, there is some uh, weight hanging at the front of my carriage so when the thing is running through the printer then there is some weight at the front of my carriage and uh, well the carriage is, is, is really uh, it's wobbling now so there is a vibration in it and well my prints are worse than they were without cooling so I have to get it away again and uh, while I was thinking this was a great way of cooling things I now know this isn't but I'm going to make another one I'm going to reinvent until I got something which is working so Maybe in the next video, or maybe not, you will see what I created then. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, then please give it a thumbs up. Also, I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel. And next Thursday, there will be another video. Thanks for watching.